So I'm not gonna do this in any particular order. We're just gonna go right. Are we just it. gonna work? We're just gonna work down the line. Basically, and Josh, you and me are gonna have a lot of input because Brent has very limited input on some of these monsters. That is very wow. true. Acidic Glavinous. Um, I want to put okay. Yeah. He's okay. What do you think about that, Brent? You think he's okay? I <laughs> mean. He's a nice variant, but he's got nothing on Hellblade. Yeah, he, yeah, I think he should be an okay. So the tiers we got here is we got best, great, mo best monster, great monster, good monster, okay, bad, awful, fucking shit. <laughs> I put near Gigante and fucking shit. <laughs> I will leave the goddamn call right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's just to piss you off. All right, Agnactor. Um, Ankator. Ankator. Was Ankator. A Sorry. Was was a fun fight for me when I played that yeah. in three ultimate on the DS. That and was a very fun fight. I remember fighting him in four and both I did it in three ult and I also did it in generations. His fight is still fun. Yeah. Oh, that's right. He was in generations. Yeah, he was. Our armor's really good, pretty good weapons. The fight's actually pretty fun. He's also got a big giant laser. Then also kind of the unique mechanic ish that they use later on for Glavinus of oh when he goes underneath he heats up and then when he's above he dries off and hardens up from his outside. You mean lava seal? You said Glavinus. No. And Kator does the same thing. Glavinus okay. also does the same thing. He heats up his blade. Oh, okay. So yeah, uh, I think he's uh, do it what. Uh, he's definitely good not monster. A, yeah, he's a good monster. Yeah, he's a good monster. Uh, have you fought the final boss for generations? I never fought the final boss for gen okay. generations personally. His fight. Uh, oh gosh, what was the name of this thing? Wait, no, we did. I think once actually. Yeah, but his fight is uh really unique, and uh, it. I actually do remember having fun with this thing. It's really chaotic that fight though. My favorite thing is the fact that when they first showed off the trailer, everyone was freaking out, thinking it was the Eagle Dragon's weapon from way back when in the <laughs> lore of Monster Hunter. <laughs> that uh, is my favorite thing. So, uh, I think I'm going to just put him right here. It's great. I don't think he's the best Elder Dragon, but I think he's a good monster, a great monster, so. Uh, now. We putting this bitch in best monster that fight was so much fun oh because it didn't have the only thing that you used to keep me alive were life powders back then because you didn't have no friendship no jewels no nothing yeah no, i don't there, even think speed eating was a thing no yet. this fight was fun this fight's actually pretty good yeah we can put him up here all oh, right god i know for a fact he's never gonna make a return but i want him to make a return okay acnosome okay brett now we can start getting your input on some of these things acnosome which one the it's the uh, parasol bird, the yeah. one that, that shoots fire. Oh, the fire umbrella. Yeah, I don't think he's. I I, th I remember him. Being, he's actually pretty decent. He was okay. I'd put him as okay. Yeah, he's not I bad. He's not he's bad. Careful. He's not good. He's kind of just. Eh. Yeah, I'm kind of in that agreement too. He's the okay monster. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Elatrion. <laughs> okay, we got to start thinking on this a little bit. Again, your guys' thing was muddied because I joined in later after everyone had to deal with all the problems of figuring out how to fight Elatrion. The real problem with Elatrion is getting players who know what they're doing. Listen, I, I mean, we can make fault with the players all we want to, which is very true. But it also goes with itself. saying... Yeah. I, I would go with the fight itself more than making fun of the players, too, because yeah. the, the age-old statement. The fight is... It's not, like, uh, rage-inducing or, like... It, it's or, chaos fun. Or boring, so I... I don't want to put him in okay, so we might just put him in good for now. He's a good mod. I mean, his mechanics are good. Yeah. Once you figure... Once we figured out what it was and the fight didn't become too bad. Oh, shit, this one. I honestly want to say bad no, just because no, awful. I fucking hate him. <laughs> yeah, oh. I hate this mud monster. I hate him so much. Fucking Wait, then, 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 then what's your opinion on Baroth then? Baroth okay, good. Different. Baroth he is good. Mud. What are you talking this, about? This guy has a fucking mud tsunami and then beats you with a fucking dirt ball. <laughs> that hurts if he hits. It's not like his subspecies isn't ain't any better. No, uh, just awful. Yeah, I, I don't like him either. He can go in there. Ooh! I have yet to ever face an Amasu. 
So, yeah. but oh, if we're, opinion. I want to give my opinion though, just on looks factor alone, because that thing is fucking cool looking. I but I fought Amatsu in both uh, in two different games, so I would still put him in not fought yet, since me and Brent have not fought him yet. No. Nope. Uh, so that if it's not fun, then that'd probably just be bad. No, 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 not fought, not fun. It's just not fought yet. Oh, we got not fought. Oh, okay. Three. Oh, okay. Yeah, we can do that. Ancient Lesson. Fucking awful. <laughs> I'm just gonna yes. put that in there. <laughs> it fucking sucks. Andrenath? We put his good. Andrenath? No. no, he ain't good. Like, no, he's not. I don't like Andrenath. No, he's not a good monster. He goes in here. Fuck that. Okay. His, his wait, fire wait. weapons are not that good. They're overshadowed by freaking Rathalos and several other monsters later on down the line, or just better. He's just meant to be that wall at lower rank, and after you beat him, you, you kind of forget about him. <laughs> and then he comes back, all charged up in thunderous rage. Dick. Okay. The pissed off honey bear, as you remember, William, is actually a really fucking funny fight. <laughs> yeah. He's a great monster. Yeah. I remember fighting him a bunch in 3 Ultimate. Oh, yeah. Ooh, well, is that Bloodbath? No, Diablo? that's Apex Diablos. Hey, Brent, remember this guy? <laughs> yeah, um... God, too bad you don't have a terrifying category. I could put one. You should. You should put terrifying. Where should I put you it? Know should, what? I that's put a it should, should I put it like underneath fucking shit? It's just like. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I put underneath shit and just put terrifying. I'm gonna. Go black. <laughs> just for terror. Oh, fu uh, oh, I should just do uh, Oh, I gotta do. Oh, this is great. It's gonna be in the video. Unless it's gonna cut out this footage. No. Oh, no. No, no. Okay, then it's just terrifying absolutely number one most terrifying fight i, I swear i need, to, I need to go back into school in order to learn this kind of stuff okay terrifying i will never forgive him for goring me in the ass <laughs> yeah his fight was scary shit apex mitsune um oh, that that's... fight is scary but it was also the weapons and the actual fight itself is good in no, my I'm opinion talking about, no this is apex mitsune is... not oh. regular mitsune that's the um, propane one, right? Yeah, that's the one that's got all those propane bubbles and stuff. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That fight uh, was fun. Uh, it was good. Yeah. yeah, I thought it was good. It's uh, it's not it's not like regular Mitsusune where you're just sliding around. No, you're just you're blowing up instead. <laughs> oh wait, why do we throw uh, Apex? Uh, is that Rathian or Rathalos? Apex Rathalos will go in fucking shit. I don't give a damn what yep. any of you guys say. I hated that guy. Okay, what about Apex Rathian down there? Once you cut the tail off, it's she's basically she's basically not that bad. And then, then Apex uh Zenogre, right? Yeah. His name is Flipsy. Apex is he, he William loves, loves Flipsy. I honestly like the world version more. The old the the ones before oh gosh, I want to cut my eyes out. Jeez, I hated that fight. But I, 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 I think one. I think he belongs in terrifying, because jeez. Mm -hmm. And then standard Azuros. I think he's good. I think he's, he's also good. good. Yeah, I think he's a good monster. He's not anything like too awful or anything. He's kind of just a good little beginner monster. I can't remember that thing's name. I just remember the fight being Ash, really annoying. Ash, get watch ya. Put him in bad. Like, he, he's not... Yeah, I, I could see it's that. Not like, uh, it's not like Anjanath kind of bad. It's just more like... He, He's, he's one of those species you really forget about. You you fight him once, you kind of forget about him, honestly. You know what? We probably could put Astalos in great now. Yeah, I because he is cool. His fight's pretty good, and yeah. the fact that he is technically a literal dragonfly is what's really funny. Yeah, I think he should be great. Granted, I would like to put him in best, but honestly, I think great's pretty fine for him. He's a great yeah. monster. Next, Aurora Sonicanth. The ice version fucking, of Somacanth. Uh, fucking awful. Put them both in awful. awful. Yeah. <laughs> when we get to Somacanth, we can put them in awful. Oh, crap. Uh, so, my... At least my opinion on... Stop it. My opinion on Rathalos isn't as bad as yours because I'm an insect glaive. Yeah, fan. we gotta talk about this first before you categorize <laughs> Fuck, it. Okay, Jesus Christ. Fine. This is... <laughs> this is a community uh, <laughs> democracy. It, it's, uh, it's less... Uh, it's, an, it's like an HOA, but with a community lead instead of a uh, just singular lead. This yeah. ain't no dictatorship. But no, I think Azure Rathalos 
probably belongs in okay, mainly because he is outshined by Silver Rathalos, because that Actually, fight... Actually, now you mention it, I just thought of the weapons, weapons and stuff. The weapons and armor is okay, so I'll just, yeah, I'll bump them up to The weapon. armor looks pretty good. The weapons are... The weapons have good fire damage. It's just, and if you're fighting this thing with Fountain Insect Glaive, it's, 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 it's awful. It's not fun. The, the sword and shield is actually pretty cool, too. Yeah. All right, uh... Do you do you remember subspecies Giganox. Giganox. The electric Regular version. Gigan I never fought the electric version. Uh but I just remember from the from the standard version of how terrifying it was when you're just like cuz AIDS were all dark back then. They didn't have any lighting in them. Yes, they and did you hear not. That? They did not. They you can you can go look at some videos of people fighting Giganox in 3 and the caves were if you didn't have a torch it was pure darkness. Oh, you fucking new players in world don't know what you didn't have to deal with. <laughs> oh gosh, I remember pissing I, my pants when I first saw. I Giga want Ox them to the bring ceiling. that back in Wild. Well, it looks like they brought that somewhat back in Wilds. The caves look darker from what we saw from one of the trailers. Yeah, we want page get... darkness. We want them to experience that. I want to see just a random spot of purple fly in front of me. All right, Banbaro. Okay, he's he's, a, he's literally the spirit of Canada itself. Yeah, he's a giant moose. Mm. We don't have Jake here, so we, uh, Baryoff. I want to say good monster. I, I like it. Like Baryoff. Yeah, he's yeah, a good monster. Yeah, I think he's good. Sorry, Jake. He's going even in here. You can voice even, your opinion down below. <laughs> even Frostfang isn't that bad. Yeah. I don't okay. Baryoff has a special place in my heart. Same. The, only, the Same. only reason why it has a special place in my heart because when I first started playing Monster Hunter and Monster Hunter Try, and the only way I was able to kill this thing, because I was dodging was I was a tank. I used a Royal Ludrath Lance, and I kept guarding and poking, guarding and poking, guarding and poking, and I was able to kill it. Me? I just took hammer and swung. That's all I did. And it's the first multiplayer monster we ever beat, too, Josh. That or is like, true. We beat that on, uh, on yeah, co-op. Yeah, I, I think he's a great monster, honestly. Oh, yeah. Brent? Oh, yeah, he's fine. Yeah, yeah. Boss... The next one, though, Basaras. Uh, I mean, granted, Good Monster is probably going to be filled up pretty good, and OK is going to be filled up pretty good. I honestly want to put him in OK. Yeah, I've, I've, he's not great, but... Eh. I faced him in 4 Ultimate, and I have faced him in, um, in Rise, and... He He's, in my opinion, he's cool. He's a giant stone yeah, dragon. Yeah, he, he, he's okay. I think he's just okay in general. Yeah. But this guy in fucking shit. <laughs> Put <laughs> basic use and his seething basic oh, use in fucking yeah. shit. No, he fucking sucks. Yeah, I, I, uh, yeah, he's a glass cannon, but jeez. He is fucking just annoying to deal with because of all the explosions. Oh my gosh. It's the Electrion fight, but just... Instead of dodging ice and fire, you're dodging explosions. And then seething basil use with exploding purple flowers. Yes, I totally want to And a freaking that. nuke. He's a freaking nuke on top of that, too. I still love the fact that Brent, when I first faced him on Go Round on World on PC, Brent just, just stood there in the middle and was like, I will accept this and lived. <laughs> okay, so from a first-time world player... I put Behemoth in Terrifying because that fight was fucking terrifying. I put that fight in Terrifying as well. Yeah, I'll put it in Terrifying too. <laughs> Beatotis. Uh, he's okay. Yeah. I don't think I he's don't wanna... bad. I, the, the armor and weapons are really good if you want early game ice weapons and the armor can get you through most of the uh, most of the game, actually. At least half I of it. want him in Good Monster only because he is just... It, he's, he's the best Piscine Wyvern out of everyone. Let's be honest he's here. The, he, true. He's also the great Jagras of Master Rank for World. He's yeah, just yeah. kind of that thing you just beat the shit out of. We're not great. Well, yeah, great Jagras. That yeah. works there. All right. Thrill Tusk Tetsukabra. No, this is Berserk Tetsukabra. This is the subspecies. Oh, Berserk. I mean, that one, that fight was just kind of fine. It was just, I mean, it was basically Tetsukabra, except he had a bigger rock, honestly. Y yeah, that one was just fine. Yeah, I'll, I'll just put him in okay. I'm wondering now, if you look at the pictures, if Tetsukabra is just a sub-off species of Ankator. Kind of does. <laughs> <laughs> kind of looks pretty close. Okay, that's it's going to spark a conversation now. Is Tetsukabra just an offshoot species of Ankator? Is Tetsukabra an elder dragon? Well, Ankator... Wait, no, a, wait, he's not. He's a flying wyvern, remember? 
Oh, yeah, oh, that's get this, right. Oh, yeah, get this, Brent. So, Ankitar on all four limbs has no wings, and he's considered a flying wyvern. Fucking hell. Is that like because the Aaron bullshit? No, 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 no. He's actually using the same skeleton and body shape of a Tigrex, but just, you know, big. All right. Yeah, he's got no wing. Hang on. Can I possibly... Yeah. You know, here I'll get I'll get pictures. Yeah, get a picture for Brent so he can so he can see. I'll get pictures, but move on to the next one. Okay. Uh, Bishotin. He's a good monster. I enjoyed his fight. I like yeah. his animations. Yeah, I think. Yeah, he's, yeah, I think he's pretty good. Oh, I yeah. especially like his subspecies. Subspecies one was actually a blast. Exploding. See this. No. Well, this is gold. This is gold beer. See this. Yeah, uh, basically, it's, just, I, it, it's basically see this when we think about God, it. God, I, I know they're never gonna add it back in because they're never gonna add in water again. But see this, even before I ever fought that thing, was one of my favorite monsters. He's probably one of my favorite of the elder dragons. Yeah, he's because got a, yeah, he's just a giant whale. He That's, really is. It's cool. Wait, he actually really you don't really. He doesn't fight you. You fight him. Yeah, he he only really shoots like <laughs> water. He yeah, he shoots water and he hits the sides of things and he's just he's just big. He's massive. He's one of the biggest monsters in Monster Hunter aside from Dalamadur and the Darren and Jin Moran. I kind of want to put him in either good or okay. Like I don't think he's great or best, but I think he's kind of like in comparison to, I think, regular Cetus, regular Cetus holds a special place in my heart. So, in yeah. my opinion, he would be in good. Regular Cetus would be in great. Yeah. Because I fa I killed that thing by myself. Yeah, I'm going to just do that. <laughs> do that now. Okay, Black Diablos. Uh, uh, no, uh, call it right. Call it right, William. I can't. My face cam's on. <laughs> <laughs> they can actually see your face this time. No, um, not really. I don't have it on. Just want to put that out there. There's the joke. My face cams. You should just put like a dumb picture of your face over that. Uh, um, uh, what should we uh, call it? My opinion's awful. I don't like the Diablos fights. I don't I, mind the Diablos I, fights I, personally. I would say bad, just because I've dealt with Diablos for a pretty long time. I like regular Diablos, but I the Black Diablos, yeah, yeah, I'll put it in bad. Oh crap, Black Gravios. Do you remember oh, this one? Oh my gosh. Oh shit. Gravios is a cool monster, don't get me wrong. It, it it's cool. But <laughs> it's a hard fight. My favorite fight though is still that that fucking small one. <laughs> I, where, wherever regular Gravios is, put him in terrifying because that was terrifying fighting the tiniest Gravios ever. Oh gosh, and you get launched halfway across the arena. <laughs> yes. Um, I think I'm just gonna put him in bad. I don't think he's. A, I don't think Black Gravios is that great of a monster. Fucking awful. Valhazak. <laughs> Do you agree with that, Josh? Yeah, he's. I Wait, have never once enjoyed. Yeah, it don't matter. It's just They're both awful. <laughs> awful. <laughs> yeah, I don't. It, it, there's like, uh, even when we're recording during some, it's so hard for me to try to cut because uh, there's like maybe like one or two good moments during the fight. It just sucks all the fun. Well, you just spend half the fight hiding. You really just... do. All right, Belonga. Do you remember this guy, Josh, in any way, shape, or form? Put him in bad. Yeah. Just because of ice blight. Oh, bloodbath Diablos. Oh, I thought what I was talking about. Terrifying. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, I still, yeah. I still remember the scary moment when I first fought him. Oh, jeez. I don't think you fought um, him, Josh. A bloodbath? I think yeah. I did once. Maybe. All right, orange Bishotten. I kind of want to put him in great. Yeah, he go. Well, oh, yeah. Where's, where's the other Bishotten? Right here in good. Oh, it's good. Yeah, so great. It's fine. Yeah. Yeah. You're cool. Ooh, Kukuyaku. Yinkuduku. Yinkuduku. The I blue mean, one. I think he's okay. I think they're okay. Yeah, they weren't bad. Yeah, they weren't like they they didn't they weren't awful, but they weren't like amazing. They were kind of just like the beginner monsters, so that eh, they're okay. Bolt Reaver Astalos. Well, I fought Asolos, and that was a good monster, but I haven't fought this Bolt one. Bolt Reaver was a whole different monster. He used magnets. Oh, yeah, Boy. and he has a lightsaber head. 
He's in a tie between fucking shit and fucking terrifying. <laughs> He's terrifying, okay? I'll never forget the first time I saw that freaking lightsaber come out of his head. Holy shit, I about dropped my 3DS. <laughs> now then, your biases aside, don't you dare badmouth my wife. But that we can at least put in as great monster. Don't you fucking, don't you fucking <laughs> dare, bitch. I can drive to your house. And I have I... two different versions of Nine Inches of Steel. My vote downvotes it to okay. Yeah, I'm it, going with okay. Because okay Sully even guy. told me to put in okay. It's... I mean, it's cool, but the blast blight is so fucking annoying. Yeah. Please tell me you can expand the bars, because it looks like this is going to get filled up pretty well. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you can. I hope so. If not, I'll just, you know... <laughs> Move down. Yeah. Brute awful. Tigrex. Fucking awful. Yeah. 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 Uh, just because of yeah. all the fucking roaring. Yeah, I'm, I'm not the hugest fan of Brute Tigrex, I'm completely honest. Bulldrome is this. I mean... Yeah, all he does is just kind of run around the that's, map and that's just all it does. Hurt you. And then you're fighting like another monster. But Josh, you got to remember the times you were fighting like another monster, and all of a sudden, just out of nowhere. Yeah, yeah, he just shows up. He's basically a big uh, boar. Yeah, that's also, all he is, Brent. Brent. That's literally all he is. Discord concept art of Ankator. Oh, okay. So, uh, that's Ankator. Ooh, he looks kind of cool. Yeah, oh, he was a. He's a he's a fantastic monster. Cephalodrome. Anyway, uh, I would say bad. Yeah, he bad. His uh, fight's bad. I mean, yeah. it got over. It gets overshadowed by Baroth anyway. Yeah. <sighs> Camellios. Camellios. Personally, I went up against him with dual blades, and it wasn't that bad for me. Resin Camellios, completely different monster to deal with. I think. Is Red for is me, resin on this list? Yeah, he should be. Okay. It it's not, we'll find out. Uh, but my biggest problem with Camellios, when I first started fighting him, I went through so many of my antidotes when I first that's, started. That's true. I I think he's okay. I'm going to go with okay. Yeah, that seems pretty good. Chaotic Gore Magala. I honestly don't have an opinion on him. I think he's... I mean, he's not bad. Yeah, he's not bad. I think he's just good. I would, I would say just good. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, too. Oh. <laughs> it... Oh, Kongalala. <laughs> Put him in bad. <laughs> the monster that fights with burps and farts. <laughs> the dude is just like if a Reddit mod got out of his basement and he had to fight off people. Oh, yeah, Brent, you gotta get a chance to look up Kongalala. Oh, I'm God, you it, it it's not as bad as you think, unless you hit rule thirty four, then it's gonna be scary. Uh, it it's just one of those of just like why why did they create this thing? So I think it was Monster Hunter two where they just had a bunch of monkeys for some reason. Yeah, I think it was Monster Hunter two is when they really got the monkeys out. And then Monster Hunter three is like let's make some a bunch of raptors. And so. And then, oh god, what was the thing for Monster Hunter 4? What was their thing then? Because they, I think they brought back the monkeys. Uh, Actually, number, no, they brought back a lot of number stuff. Number 4 actually. was the bugs, remember? They were bringing in all oh, the bug that's, monsters. Yes, that's right, the bugs. All anyway, right. We're getting, off, we're getting off topic. Coral puke, Coral, puke. Bad. Yeah. Yeah, it, you just gotta cut the tail off, and he's basically, you're basically good after that. Crimson Fatalis belongs in best. I know regular Fatalis is a bitch. I don't well, we'll remember get there. why. Don't, don't worry, people. We'll get there. We'll get there. But Crimson Fatalis is a awesome fight. I Both had fun with him in the Valstrax. I want to say best. Best. Yeah. Yeah. Best. You have to no put one the, rock, can, no. the rocket monster. The rocket he monster. Is, he is Elton John, but not gay. Oh. Yeah, that was. Oh, I remember having. Yeah, he's always a fun fight every time you face him. Okay, okay, we are putting. Uh, oh God, it's Crimson uh, Crepeco, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Crimson Crepeco. Put him in fucking terrifying only because he summons Devil Joe. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I have a lot of and great moments from from Try and Three Ultimate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And when Devil Joe shows up, oh, you you shit yourself. Yeah, Everybody and that's when himself. he got introduced, and everyone had a. First time fighting Corpeco, and this is like, oh, because he'll do a roar, and you're like, oh, it's just a rat thing, because that's usually 
what he used to summon all the time, right? Nope. <laughs> well, in, like, high rank, when you were in, like, in low rank, it was always a Rathian. So then you hear that, and you're like, that's not a Rathian. And then here comes the pickle. Christer Beard the- Yurngaran. Christer? What? Who the fuck? Chris, you said Christer. So, oh, sorry. Crystal you Beard. You said Crisco. Crisco. Oh. Crisco. <laughs> Crisco, Crisco Beard. beard, beard your mm. Oh. <laughs> is Brand, that just like- lard? Is that just his whole entire thing is lard? Just lard. Brian, you like that uh that greasy John Lennon gym <laughs> or chin, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> I, I honestly, I, I I've never fought Crystal Beard. I think uh, he's he's. He's it sounds boring. like he's fucking he, shit. He, yeah, he's boring. He's awful. I don't really. Darren Moran. Darren Moran. It belongs in best. Yes. Only because of, aside from nostalgic purposes, but that fight was just so much fucking fun to do. Oh, Brent, yeah. imagine just a two parter long siege to where you fight it on a sand boat and you shoot shit at it, and then eventually you can go onto the monster and mine off of it, but also do damage yeah. to it. And then no. eventually. He just walks closer and closer and closer. And William one time waited until he was like right on top of me to hit the gong to scare it back. I'm just like, you <laughs> fucking dick. Yeah, no, we fought that on the... Yeah. Oh, that's right. We did make you fight that on 4 all. Yeah. DMO? It was just so much fun. Yeah. DMO Hermitar. Oh, is that the... Um, crab. That was the, the, that was the, the crab. Red crab. The red crab. Oh, the crabs are okay. Yeah, just okay. Yeah, 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 I can agree with that. Senator fucking sucks. He does? I when I first fought him, I didn't like oh. him because all the bleed. I I find I find he's I thought he was fine. I didn't know about bleed back then, so that was fun to deal with. Oh, uh Dalmadur. Best. Yeah. Just no, put him in front of Ankator. Best. <laughs> uh Dead Ayangaruga's fucking terrifying. You have yeah. your opinion. I have Insect Glaive. <laughs> No, here's the thing. If you thought Yinger, if you thought Temper Yingurga's cracked, this guy is double that. Holy shit. He's like twice as fast and hits twice as hard. Yeah, I know. I faced him. Again. And, and traps insect work glaive. On him. Insect glaive. Okay, uh I just ignore most of your guys' problems by being in the air. Well yeah, well fuck you too. Anyway, we got <laughs> Desert Celtus and Celtus Queen. I remember both of them being just kind of I mean, they were cool. Don't get me wrong, but I think, they were kind of okay. Uh, Deserts, it, they're basically just the regular Celtics and stuff, so I think Celtics Queen is good. I think I'll just put him as okay. Oh, the list expands. Yeah, so I think I'll just put Celtics as okay. He wasn't... Devil Joe belongs as great monster. Yeah. Even Savage belongs as great monster, because in World, fighting that thing in World is awesome. Fighting a thing in Monster Hunter 3, 3 Ultimate, or even 4 Ultimate... Terrifying. It, There's it, only one thing more terrifying than that, and that is Starving Devil Joe, but that was only in the Frontier series. I only know about that thing because God, I just, it looked terrifying. Alright, I put Diablos in okay. Yeah. I, I like I like regular Diablos more than Diablos. Okay, Dire Morales. I honestly want to just say maybe good? I've done his fight. Yeah, I, I don't it's think okay. I got that far when it came to 3 Ultimate, if I recall. So, he was the monster who was added into 3 Ultimate just as a, a new monster, and he's never shown back up again. Yeah. Which, his fight's kind of cool, because it's both on land and in water, Yeah, but... I, yeah, I think good is good for... Dodo Gama. I feel like we should have a, a tier for he's just precious. Yeah. Hang on. Just because he kind of... Ex- he's like Doug from the Godzilla Monsterverse series. He's just Doug. You like what I did there? <laughs> Best bo- Oh, wait, yeah, I should just do that. Hang on, I'm doing it. Doug. Just Doug. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Doug. Just Doug. Dread, Dread King and Dread Queen, I both want to say are okay. Yeah. I would have to put Dread Queen in bad. Just because her poison is fucking scary. Her poison sucks. Jeez. Yeah. Oh, God. Drill Tusk Tetsukabra is basic. I think they took Tetsukabra and honestly made that fight better, honestly. Yeah. Maybe he does a little bit more spinning, but. Yeah. I'm, yeah. 
I'm putting him in good. Good. Duramboros. Put him in great monster only for just spin. Spinny the spin. Wee the, the wee. spin. It it is just he's such a good monster. Plus, I feel like he's like Torterra from Pokemon. Yeah. He has an entire ecosystem on his back. I don't know anyone that cool. hates uh, Durambros, if I'm completely honest. I think everyone just I, likes him. I want them to bring him back. I know they're never going to do it, but I want them to bring him back. Yeah, Either maybe. that, I want a biome specific version to come out in Wilds. Like, yeah. if they have. We all, we've only seen kind of like one or two different biomes in the trailer right now, but having different biome versions, because there was a sand one too. Yeah, that would be so cool. Like a swamp version or like a volcanic version. I feel like the volcanic version would just look like. Uh, Oh gosh, we just said his name. That Elder Dragon we just put in good. Dire Morales? Dire Morales, thank you. Okay, Ebony Odogaron. I would have to say is probably okay. Yeah, he's okay. Yeah. Both I, fights are okay. Yeah. Is oh. that Silver Gameth? Or yeah, yeah that's Sil Silver yeah, Gameth. Yeah, that's Silver Gameth. I want to say good. Yeah. Yeah, I can go with good. It's same thing for Gameth. Gameth is Gameth's just a cool monster just because. Yeah, he's, I'm just putting both in there. Emerald Kongalala belongs in the same tier as his yes. counterpart. Espinas. Awful. Okay, hang on. Regular Espinas. Regular, regular Espinas. Regular Espinas is good. I also think for the other Espinas, which we'll get to later, I'll save that opinion there. But Espinas, I think was, I'd say he's probably okay to deal with. Yeah. Maybe bad if, honestly, you find him when he's sleeping, so you can just explode him. So he's only bad if you just... Yeah. Don't capitalize with I don't bombs. really have a I don't really have a problem with him, so uh but since okay. Brent said awful, I'll just put him in okay. Alright, Josh. Vent it out. If we're on Fatalis, vent it I'm out. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get angry while I'm saying it at least, but God, I just hate the fact that you can't have your boys with you to fight the thing at first, because you have to get past a certain damage threshold. I mean I'm not the best monster hunter, but I definitely ain't the fucking worst. But still, fighting him, his entire hitbox is his body. You can't, you can't dodge it. You just, you have to hope and pray. In my opinion, I have to hope and pray. I'm not as skilled as our god of the hunt, William. <laughs> but it, yeah, it's just, uh, it just seems painful. Speak it. Uh, so, Brent, have have you ever had fun fighting this guy? Fun? No, I have had fun in groups that are dedicated to fighting him, but that's about it. Yeah, same, so... Honestly, he feels like a Dark Souls boss to me. Yeah, okay. Flaming Espinas. Back to back. My opinion is, he's actually not bad in my opinion. I would, personally, I put him in good monster, only because it's kind of the same thing with the Elatrion fight. It's just, whoever you have with you... Should I just put him in bad? Is, I, just I would just put him in bad just so we can kind of meet in the middle because I know you both think he fucking sucks. But I'd say it's, he's good. It's, it's, only, yeah. it's only because of the people who run in there and be it's, like, oh, it's just, just gonna fire I don't get it. It's like, oh, big giant fireballs coming at me. Let me run towards it. Oh my gosh, the camera angle changed. What should I do? <laughs> just like, what are to you doing? Fair, we have that same shit with Safi Jiva. So. I remember that fight with, when I was doing it with Brent. We had this one, two dumbasses that ran towards him. And Brent just got so ticked off. That's stupid. <laughs> Frostfang Baryoff. Um, I think he just belongs with this guy, with his yeah. with his other with his counterpart up here. I'd yeah. say he'd go with great, but uh, I can go with good too. Yeah, we got. We'll give Jake a little bit of. We'll give Jake a little bit. Listen, he's Canadian. He's a bitch just naturally. It's. Uh. It just comes with the territory. Mm. Uh, uh, unless, you know, a after what their other parliament stuff is doing. that th Their shit's fun to watch. All right. Fulger. The idiots can't vote. No, they can. Well, they don't can. you know they can't vote? Because they're, they can't vote at all, kid. Don't you know? And F Fulger is just fucking shit. Yeah, I yeah. can throw him in there too. I pers again, my opinion is I don't I have an insect glaive. I can fly over, but I'm not using insect glaive. Yeah, but he's just kind of shit. All right, furious rushing, angry monkey. Oh, first off, that's your son, and second, I would put him in good. Yeah, he was a yeah. good fight. Terrifying, yeah. but good. Yeah, terrifying. <laughs> but it's good. it's only the tempered version. Let's be honest. <laughs> yeah. Oh crap, what the fuck was this thing's name? 
I can't remember his name, Castle but basically. Castle Column? What? The, the end boss for yeah. Monster Hunter R for Rise. I thought it was kind of fun. I thought the fight oh, yeah, was no. actually fun. I would put him in Great Monster. He was a good fight. Yeah, I thought so too. Brent, you agree with this? He's not here. Oh god, no. <laughs> He's been attacked again. At least he <laughs> muted himself. Okay. Um. Oh, he fucked off. No, he hasn't. He was just grabbing his cinema. Is that what he calls it? <laughs> <laughs> it's got cream all over it, too. I knew it. <laughs> Will you keep this in the video? <laughs> oh, man. Oh, jeez. Anyway, giant monkey. Garen Golem. I'd say good. Yeah, I think he's good. I'd say good. I'd say he's good. Oh, Gendrome and uh, Iodrome. No, Gendrome and uh, crap. What's this thing's name? It's the ice version. Oh, I think the drums are just not. They're not good monsters, honestly. They're Except kinda... one. We'll get to him later, though. Yeah, I think Gendrome. Do you, should we just put all the other ones in like awful or something? I want to say yeah. They're not very good. Yeah. Regular Giganox but... is belongs in terrifying. Yup. Agreed. Because we already discussed it. Yeah. Agreed. Glacial Agnactor. I faced him a couple times. I mean, he's different of a fight. Yeah, but he's not too different from Agnactor, so I think we could just put him right next to him. Yeah. Might as well. Glavinus, in my opinion, is a great monster because he was a nice challenge when they first released him in Generations. Okay, so I've heard okay. some negatives about him, but that's just because they, they always say he like he's too fast for his size. But yeah, I honestly, from that. what when I fought him, I don't think he's as fast as people claim that so, he is. He, here's the cool thing you can do, or just in general when it comes to design. So he has a massive tail. That helps him a lot with balance, because his tail is the length of his body, if not more. So that's why he can move that way, is because that thing is just basically there to keep him balanced and up and straight. So are we saying great or good, or...? I want to say great. Yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. You okay with... Alright. Yeah. That's fine. Google! I want to put him in either good or terrifying. <laughs> Honestly, I'm saying terrifying because I'll remember the because, first he just popped out of nowhere and just like <gasps> what? So in underwater in underwater combat, bro, he actually he's like a, a flounder and a pufferfish and an anglerfish all combined into one. Someone mm -hmm. really went down to the deep sea and decided, you know what, I'm gonna combine these things to one creature. And so he can make himself flat and then hide underneath the sand and then pop out with a massive mouth and bite you. And he walks on land too, and his he does paralysis too with his spikes, and it's just oh, oh gosh. The man. interesting oh, thing gosh, though, the spikes. Oh man. Hold on though. Here's the interesting thing. Puke Puke's hammer is actually his hammer. His hammer way back when was that yeah, cloud. Yeah, that's except, freaking right. Except when you charged it up, spikes would come out of it. Yeah, that's right. So oh, they man. quite literally reuse the hammer. Okay, Gogmosius goes right in here. That fight was fucking awesome. Yeah, uh, this thing is what... No, you get in front of everyone, Gogmosius. You get in front of everyone. I don't know. I think Dalmadur was still pretty good, no, too. No, no, Gogmosius was top tier. Hang on. Eh, eh, eh. Let me fix that. There hey, you go. You gotta explain why. It's is, the tar pit dragon. He's everything that they tried to make Fatalis. Yeah. Okay. Like how? So, like explain. Like how so, so. He's got a dragonator on the back of him that you can knock off and use it against him. It's a literal dragonator attached to a dragon. And he's got a big, giant, like beam. Like I'm talking like Godzilla, like beam. If memory serves, he also just exudes kind of. Oh, this is gonna sound like a crazy person, but he has an aura to him, a literal aura because of all the black ooze that's dripping off of him, and the red eyes and the sharp teeth, and just with. The way he's designed, he's meant to just look terrifying. And the smiley face underneath the chin. You, you it's still. You don't remember. He's a good that? fight. Yeah. The what now? You don't remember the smiley face that's underneath his chin? Oh, that yeah. Yeah. He's a was a really fun fight at the end of the of, of the game. It's like they they did the, it, everything they tried to hype up Fatalis for. It was honestly all Gogmosius. Yeah, and Gogmosius' his memory surface is bigger than Fatalis, but Fatalis is also just. 
it's the destroyer, but it has to reach a certain point. Uh, mm-hmm. If that one's on this little picture, because I think it was in Monster Hunter Two, we'll, we'll wait. Yeah, Gold Rathian. I mean, Personally, gold and silver. I mean, they're. I, I, I put them both in either good or great because I, they're. I, I mean, good. I mean, they're not great fights, but I think she's good. I honestly say it's great when they're both together, only because William flips his shit in terror, not in fury. <laughs> All right. Ray Magala belongs in one of the best monsters because yes, he yeah. he set the stage in Four Ultimate, and I was so hyped when he came over into Generations. Monster- no, and not the Generations, Generations in and Rise. Rise. Let's be honest, it was both in Rise. It, he's just he is the Edge Lord, but they played him off good because they didn't do the traditional Edge Lord thing of going black and red. No, they went black and purple. They made one of the most like girly ish colors because purple's not entirely girly of a color like pink but they still made it scary oh yeah he was yeah he also exhumes a presence too during that story. because he has a literal presence in that story he causes frenzy <laughs> oh uh gosharag uh was that the ice with the ice bear thing yeah that yeah, was the ice bear with blades yeah I he was okay i'm half tempted yeah. but then terrifying I mean, yeah, when he, gets, when he gets his ice blades, that is terrifying. True. Yeah, uh, I'll just put him in okay. Sound good? Yeah, just the next one is the is the one we have to put in terrifying because tiny version of that is scary. Yeah, he really was. Tiny Gravios is scary. Great Boggy. Put him in okay. Yeah. I think it was okay if I... The only really bad thing is the sleep, and all you gotta do is roll to the left or right, and you're fine. Yeah. Great Gyros. Put him in just awful, because no one ever fights him. <laughs> like he's like done. Boldrome. Uh, great Izuchi. I honestly think he's a good monster. Yeah. 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 He was a... What, he's like the... Uh, <gasps> great Joggy belongs as... Oh, you're doing a new category. <laughs> Hang on, I'm doing this. Yes, he is. <laughs> Great Joggy is everyone's challenge. They did not pull the punches when they first this oh. monster was first implemented. Oh my gosh, he was a punching bag. <laughs> he was a punching bag, yes, absolutely. But he wasn't near a punching bag as, like, say, Great Jagras or the rest of them down the line. Because he actually could hold his own in a fight. <laughs> oh. I want him to come back. Yeah, I would love to so see it. Yeah, I want to see it. Okay, I'm just going to go. Yeah, I'm just going to do that. He is, he is great joggy. Yeah, it's just great joggy. He's like Bidoof from Pokemon. Also, yeah. uh, we might as well just put great Jagras and Doug. Yeah, he is. <laughs> he's, he's, he's Doug. Great Macau. Ah, see, say bad just because his fight was annoying to deal with. Yeah, I don't really, I don't remember really liking him. Great Wargy. Poison, the poison sputer. Yeah, I know. I want to say okay. Yeah, that I, one was yeah, okay. Yeah, I think he's like right up in here. He was, he was like Great Boggy. All you had to do was roll to the left or right. Yeah. Now, his little Wargies that were around with him, fuck them because they would show up randomly and poison you. Yeah. Green Nargakuga. He was basically I mean, Narcacuga. That's yeah, I know it was basically Narcacuga, but it was like a green parakeet. Yeah. Um, okay. If we're talking Narcacuga, I think he's a good monster. No, we can go with good. Or we could we go great because his weapons and armor are all pretty good. No, because World kind of nerfed his weapons a little bit. I guess that is true. Yeah, we can put him in there. Green Plezioff. Put him in fucking shit. Gladly. Gr- <laughs> Grimclaw Tigrex. Grimclaw. Oh my god, that was a great fight. Oh, and his weapons all look so fucking cool. Oh yeah, cool. that was a sh- yeah, great monster. The, o- the only thing that overshadows him is Molten Tigrex, and Brent's lucky he never had to face that thing, because that thing was pure terror, but it was pure terror and joy at the same time. Gypsaros? Honestly, no, 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 don't even make a new one. Just delete him. Just delete the icon. Just what? delete Gypsaros. I-, I can't delete it. I can't. I'm just gonna... I'm, the- I'm, I'm creating one. I'm creating one. Uh... I want to delete this one. <laughs> Do we each get one delete? Well, no. I know William wants to delete this one. 
I say we all get one delete. It's not worth me putting my dick in. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's beautiful. Let's be honest. I, I'm doing that. I, it's just, it's just, she's just an awful fight. Ugh. Flashbang, poison, steals your, tail, steals your items, rubber body, so he's immune to electric, and then he also fakes his death more than once. Jeez. Uh. Okay. Jen Moran, but this is the uh, Crystal Jen Moran and regular Jen Moran belong in probably great because their fights are just good. They're not great monsters, or they're not like the best fights ever. Darren Moran's is a little bit different, but they're good. Hellblade belongs in, in fucking terrifying. If we yes, could add yes, it. yes, yes. Oh, oh my gosh. Jeez. I almost forgot some of those fights I had to deal with him. Jeez. Fucking terrifying yeah. just because of how big he was and how much damage he did, and how that one makes sense for how fast he is. Oh my gosh, he was just, just, he was off the wall, off the wall oh, how fast he was. Oh god, yeah, he was. And I think that's Iodrome, isn't it? Yeah, that's Iodrome. What was his gimmick? Was it also poison? Yeah, it was poison too. Put him with Wargy, I guess? I mean, he's the same thing. Basically, Ivory the guy or Chris. That one, I remember fighting in... I think it was four ultimate. That one was a great monster. Yeah. That was a fun fight. Jade Baroth. That one for me, I fought it before. That one's a pretty good fight as well. I'm sad they haven't brought him back yet. Yeah. No, no good fight. Not great. Good fight. Oh, oh, good monster. Oh, okay. He's a good monster. Jiro Toros. Honestly, that's a Doug. You hear yeah, that, Brent? Doug. Yeah, Doug. Okay. He's a dog. Catch a watcha. Put him in fucking shit. Or explain. Off. Really? You hated him? Explain. I don't like. I don't like catch a watcha. What? Honestly, just for him, just alone, I just don't like him. Uh, okay, I'll put him in bad, but hey, we, I. We, we need more of a reason than I just don't like him. I <laughs> literally just don't like his fight. It was just annoying for me. He's a he's a lemur monster. So, and uh. Jeez, uh, how, how do you describe him? Jeez. Um, uh, imagine an elephant, a monkey, and one of those desert dogs that has the really big ears had a baby, and they also decide to give it really long middle fingers with claws on them. Okay, then. I didn't yeah. have a problem with him at all, so... Not a problem. Kezu, either below... <laughs> really? <laughs> I would say man? he's okay. It's a dick itself, man. I know it's a dick, but I don't think it was that bad. I hate this guy. I don't like him at oh, all. Oh, wait, wait. It's probably because Insect Glaive main. Mm. Yeah. That might be why. Uh, freaking, oh, geez, what are these things? Shakalakans. Never fought them. At least that, that I remember. Uh, yeah, I'll just put them in here. They're, eh, they're kind of more annoying. Kieran! Awful. Really? Not terrifying? No. Just awful fighting. I guess that's true. That's only when he's, like, tempered or something. <laughs> I feel like Kukliaku... Okay, here's the thing, though. There's standard Kukliaku, which is just annoying to fucking deal with. Then there was the behemoth Kukliaku that grabbed that giant crystal, grew to about a giant size, and don't even fucking put him in bad. Put him in fucking awful, only because of that one fucking reason. Okay, good enough. That one reason alone. <laughs> that one reason alone. I do not want to fucking deal with a giant goddamn Kukliaku. Alright. Kuv Taroth. It either belongs in best or great. Again, it's one of those situations of if you have good players. I think we'll put so, Big Mike in uh, Great Monster. Yeah. Yeah. Kushala Deora. Insect Glaive. I can't put my opinion on this one. You two talk it out. Fucking awful. Yes. Uh, fucking shit. I'm putting in fucking shit. It doesn't even deserve to be awful. That's a... Tornadoes are so annoying. Oh my like... god. <laughs> Why did they do Insect Glaive. I don't, have to... I don't have to deal with any of this shit. Oh yeah, fuck you too. <laughs> nope, that's gay. You know what? If we get him in the world, uh, if we get him into Wilds, uh, Brent, he does, he's banned from using Insect Glaive. Yo. Wait, what do you mean if? What makes you think I'm not? 
Okay. Yep. That is decided. You're banned from Insect Glade. Yep. You're banned fuck from Insect Glade. You aren't going to use Insect Glade for more. No. Fuck you. I'm using. Insect We're going to make Glaive. him longsword. <laughs> no. Fuck you. I'm using Insect Glade. Uh, well, we don't know if Jake's going to be there, so you know someone's got to fill the void. Okay. We all know Jake's not going to be there because yeah. he's going to be too busy sucking Cam's dick. Jake can have the Insect Glade. That's Jake will not have my baby. That would be that entertaining to watch. I actually kind of want to see him do that. I think all right, be then. Never, all right, Brett. No longsword for you. William. No charge blade for you. But yeah, okay. you use hunting. To... Hang on. No, <laughs> then you can use hunting horns. Now you let me use my fucking insect hunting glaive. horns. Yes. Now let me use my fucking insect glaive. Are you two going to use hunting horns? Hey, so one of them does the baby seals fucking noise. Yeah, that's all that matters. <laughs> <laughs> also, Legiacris, we got to put it as great monster. Just because no. right after I killed Baria. I'm putting in best monster. Baria. I'm putting best monster, man. Oh, sorry. That's what I meant. Best monster. But right yeah. after I killed Baroth, I went to go find that thing and it fucking killed me. <laughs> Gee, I when I beat this is the first time where I fought in Monster Hunter where I fought when I beat this guy, I felt so accomplished. I felt so accomplished for that. The Gombi either belongs in Doug or Awful. Eh, I'm going I'm going awful. His fight's not really that fun yeah. to deal with. And for Luci he, uh Lucian? I think his name was Lucian. Yes. Yeah, I felt I felt bad for that guy. Uh, Lao Sheng Lung. Honestly, I want to say good because he's just a giant siege fight. Uh, he kind of does like nothing. Yeah. During the I mean, fight, so... he's a gigantic elder dragon, though. Like uh, he's as I'll... he's as big as a fucking building. Yeah, I'll put him in bad because just because they need to get a fight where he actually does stuff. Is it just? Uh, well, he's too big. Yeah, but w we have a better, you know. Consoles, like, I probably take it more. Okay, Lava Sea off. Meh? Yeah, that's meh. Yeah, eh, yeah, he's okay. Fucking awful. Both it and Shrieking. Yeah, honestly. <laughs> but, it's a, it, just... but you have an Insight Glaive, Josh. Uh, surely it can't be that bad for you. He's still got not, when there... not when there's two of them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh... Ancient Leshen is bad. I personally think Leshen's fight is, like, okay. Because I've done this fight more than once. I think it's okay. I don't think I've ever, I don't think I've ever fought in it, actually. I haven't either. No I idea. think Leshen's so, fight is okay. It's actually... I would say, I would say put it in not never fought because we have two who've never fought it. Oh, okay. But I personally yeah. think it's okay. Sometimes I fought this thing, and it's actually a really good fight, so... Now, that's Silver Wing Nargakuga, right? Yes, this is the one that goes invisible. Yeah, I think I fought that thing a couple times. That fight's fun. That's a me thing. And that's even without an insect glade. That fight's just I, fun. That's because I pay attention to everything. Oh, I thought this fight was absolutely fun. I thought it was a blast. Uh, we probably go with either good or great then. Brent? Oh, his fight was fine, so good's fine. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Good enough for me. Nuno Garon. Uh, uh -huh. Actually, I enjoyed that fight. Yeah, I yeah, I'd like have to it. say great. That was a great fight. I still need to have a talk with Firestar over that incident. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like somebody didn't get any healing. No, it's more like my no. cat was... It, Brett can tell you exactly what happened. He got a flower. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Lunastra. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you know my feelings on Lunastra. You guys outnumber me on this one. I would still even put it in bad, but if you guys want to put it in fucking shit, go right ahead. I mean, the fight itself's not shit. It's just her AOE and her tail. I'm just gonna do mean. awful. I don't think she's shit because her weapons and armor in the early when world at near the end of world, Josh, they were actually pretty good. Yeah. So it was kind of worth it. So I'll just put her in awful. She's not shit. Yeah, her weapons were pretty good back then. Okay, the magma version of this. Put him in the same spot, I guess. Still fucking awful. Yeah. Where is oh where awful? It's awful. Oh, there you are. Magnamalo. Great fight. Yeah, I like great his fight. fight. He's a great monster. What? He is. How? How? He's just cool. He's like near Gigante. He's just he's the flagship monster. But they made him cool. Don't you put him in okay? Put him in I great. don't you like got... him. I'm sorry. This is not a dictatorship. This is a community okay, voting. Okay, fine. He in... goes in good. I ain't put him in good. I ain't put him in best or great. Fuck you put both. Him at the, put, it, put him at the top of good. Fine. <laughs> yeah. I fucking hate that guy. 
Is it Malzino? Is that the no, name? No, that's Malfestio. I honestly want to say that that fight was bad just because of all the sleep that it did because it wasn't like a... Well, the biggest problem with it was it would reverse your controls. Do you remember that? Oh, oh that's right. That too. Yeah, no, never mind. Fucking awful. <laughs> I remember Honestly, it putting you to I sleep. I completely, I completely memory blocked until you reminded me that it reversed my controls. <laughs> Ori originally, it was just bad when my brain was protecting me, but no, you had to just awaken that memory of him reversing it. Either put him in awful or fucking shit. Uh, I, I, first of all, I didn't, I, I didn't think he was too bad, but I'm, I'm gonna put him in bad. I, I didn't think he was awful. I think he was just kind of bad for me personally. Uh, he wasn't too bad because once I figured out how to fight backwards, it wasn't too bad. This one's the vampire dragon. Malzino. That's the one where NCH production went into their furry age. Which I'm kind of sad they did that, but. I think this is a good monster. I say it's a good monster too. It's not great, but I think it's good. It was a good fight. Mitsusune. Mitsusune was originally introduced in three ultimate, not three ultimate, in generations, generations and generations double cross or yeah. ultimate. Whatever they called it. I remember calling it Double Cross because yeah. it just took a long time to get here. Anyway, I remember that thing being pretty cool to fight, even though you slide around in the bubbles, but I'd have to put Honestly, it in Honestly, the slide with the bubbles was fun. It was a, it was kind of fun to, to do that. It really was. <laughs> Plus, it makes you look like a Japanese fox person. Yeah. Um, I think he's good. Yeah, that's it. Good, too. Brent? Yeah? Don't, if, don't forget, you can get your input on this if you can. I... Mo Starter monster. I mean, she was. I like the propane one better. Uh, yeah, molten Tigrex belongs up with Great Juggy only because he's only been featured once, but he is he left just that much of an impact. Oh, of yeah, how terrifying it. his right? weapons he were had, so good, too. He was bright red and he caused explosions. Oh, he's lovely. ever he's like the final form of Tigrex. But here's the thing he doesn't roar that much. And he starts out really slow. It's only when he gets angry when he gets fast. Didn't he also have a specific blast type? It wasn't like regular blast. It was a different type of blast. Skull blast. That's what it was. Yeah. It went off a lot more faster. A lot more faster. Great English. Hey, I'm, getting, so much, I'm getting much better. Mm. I'm getting more better. Monobolos, I think, belongs with Diablos. Just uh, honestly... It, okay. I think, honestly, I think I like Monobolos more than, uh... Salt. It is cooler But than I think he's on the Diablos. verge of good. I think he's on the verge of good. Correct. I can agree with that one. Okay, oh God, Narjalala. I can't this. Narjalala. I don't remember that thing being that bad. I think he's okay. Yeah? He was an okay fight. He didn't yeah, leave he... too much of a lasting impact on me. He was, what, just basically a giant snake? Yeah, that does, like, sonic blast, but, yeah, that was about it. He was just okay. Yeah. Oh god, I can't remember this one's Narcorosis, name. Narcorosis, big fucking laser. I remember him, and I remember that laser being fucking cool. Put him in Great Monster. Yeah. <laughs> Just giant fucking lasers. Oh man, that, that fight was fun. Namiel. Namiel. Okay. Yeah. 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 Cool design, but man. Yeah, I can see him definitely being okay. Uh, mm -hmm. where did we put Nar Great Narcokuga? Yeah, right here. Oh. Yeah, we just... Narwa. I've only faced that one once compared to the other one. I mean, it's okay. Hmm. It didn't yeah. leave that much of a lasting thing on me. Yeah, it was... Uh, yeah, what about you, Brent? Which one? No, oh, Narwa. I did not care for that fight. I'd say yeah. awful. Yeah, I'll just put it in... Bad. Yeah, put it in bad. Put a bottom tier bad. Yeah. All right, I don't grab near Gigant. Yeah, we it, it there's. I'm sorry, he has to go right here. And you might as well grab Runer as well and put Runer in front of him because Runer is just so fucking cool. Any any objections here? So, near Gigante and Runer near Gigante. Oh yeah, no, absolutely. They were fucking fantastic, especially for the fact that Runer himself literally faked his own death to come back and kill a bitch. Oh, Nursilla. Oh, that was the one from 4 Ultimate, wasn't it? Yeah, the little venomous spider. I think he's good. I, I'd say good, too. That fight was pretty cool. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Nibble Snarf. 
I want to say that was a good fight only because of two things. Number one, his fucking name. <laughs> <laughs> and what he did. But also, I remember fighting him a lot. I'd say he was a good monster. Yeah, I don't, there's several people that don't like him. My honest opinion is, uh, from what I can tell... They don't like it because he's in the sand so much and they don't know how to get him out. Okay, just do what you do with Diablos and throw some sonic bombs. Apparently Bam, they're not quite solved. as effect apparently they're not quite as effective. Well either that, they just don't know how to aim. Personally, also, I never I had a problem know. with him in the sand, honestly. I just kinda just beat him up until he gets out and then I just fish him out. Yeah. Basically. You could put barrel bombs down. I've seen that a few times, so uh, we've done that a few times. <laughs> honestly, I think I'll just put him in okay. Yeah. Yeah, I think he's just okay. okay. Uh, never fought this thing. I don't think I did either. And I think we could probably put uh, Night J. Palomalu in just awful. Yeah. If you don't have sleep, it's just... Oh, no, Garon. I think he's okay. Just kind of up here with his little brother right here, too. Yeah. Yeah. Oroshi Kirin. Do you remember this one, Josh, in any way, certain way? I remember fighting it a couple times, and I just remember the fight either being really bad or just really or okay. I think he's better than Kieran, so he just goes up one tier. Yeah, yeah. It's instead of lightning, Brent. It's ice. Oh. So the thought process behind it is that the Kieran eventually evolved into controlling a different element, so that it could fight off against a Rajang, because Rajang's weakness is actually ice, or at least one of its weaknesses. Yeah. So, in other words, adaptation to fight off against something. Wait, does that mean there's going to be an ice rushing in the next game? Well, when you think about it, Kieran's, what is Kieran's big weakness? Fire. Fire. Oh, God. <laughs> Fire monkey. <laughs> I'm just going to call it with Uh, Palomulu. Honestly, Doug. Yeah. Yeah. He's Doug. Pink Rathian is probably either bad or awful only because she adds that little spin to her poison and it's just annoying to deal with. And Plesios, we could put in, yeah. Yeah. It, it's just it's just not. It's, nope. It has it, the it, most it, notable hip check ever. So, Brent, you know Lava Seoth's hip check? Yeah. yeah. This thing is the king at doing a hip check. It could, it could move a mountain with that hip check. And it was just annoying to deal with because oh its hitbox was just bullshit. Because it was the, in it wasn't just like certain parts of the monster. No, it was even underneath its tail where it didn't even physically touch you, and it would still hit you. It they was not, awful. They bring it. They better not bring it back. They better not bring it back. Otherwise, I'll unlock alcoholism. Alcoholism. <laughs> New ability unlocked. Alcoholic. Okay, purple hermitar. I don't remember too much other than it's just basically Hermitar, so I'm just gonna put it, right, put it right next to it. Puke Puke? I don't feel like it's like Doug. I think he's okay. Yeah, he's okay. He's not a Doug, but he's okay. Yeah. You should probably put that gy other Gypsuros with the other one. He's even yeah. worse. He's even worse. Purple Ludroth, I actually remember, was being pretty fun. I would say he was good. Yeah. Oh, uh, wait. Oh, wait, he's just all that. Uh, I'll put him at good, yeah. I'll put him at good. Yeah. Pyro Ragna Kataki. I don't remember that one being a bad fight. I don't know what to put it in, but I don't remember it being a bad fight. The Fire Spider. I don't... Oh. That one was okay. Yeah, yeah. I find that... I think Ragna Kataki is just okay in general. Yeah. Corpeco oh. probably belongs in Good Monster. Yeah. Just yeah. because he's a different challenge. Yeah. I remember having fun with that guy. Oh, Radabon. We could throw Radabon down fucking awful after you got knocked off three times if you want to. I hey, don't have a problem with him. Hey, you could shut up, okay? I know you got a front row scene of that, but that was bullshit. And you put my son in Great Monster right now, or Best Monster. Uh, you know his weapons are uh, fucking good. You know his <laughs> weapons are good. Brent, you can second this with the weapons, right? Is that Raging Brachidios? Yeah. Yes. Oh, yeah, no, his weapons are great. Great monster. Great monster. 
Great monster, you bitch. <laughs> you can put him at the bottom of great if you want to. Uh, no, like, I'm, I'm a, doing this. I actually, real, uh, I actually like Raging Bracadillo, surprisingly, actually. Don't you dare badmouth my son. Like, we're about to badmouth your wife. <laughs> okay, uh, Rajang. Um, Regular Rajang. He's okay. Yeah. 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 Okay, we can probably lump these two together as well. Rathalos and Rathian. Okay. okay. Yeah. 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 Uh, a lot of monsters are going to be in okay. Yeah, because there's a ton I mean, of them that are kind of just great, but meh. they're a they're a challenge. Because Red yeah. Hell Azuros is uh just as good as Azuros in my opinion. He's good as all of the Azuroses. Yes, yeah, so I think he's good. Red, Red Kezu. Wouldn't know. I've heard about him, but wouldn't know. Yeah, I want to say he's not that. He has a little bit more redeeming qualities than Kezu, but he's still shit. All of the resin dragons, I have only fought Camellios, and I think I fought the other one actually. I think I fought Valstrax once. I put bad. I don't like his invisibility. Yeah, uh, Valstrax. I you thought fought that one once. It's he just hits really hard. Oh, Valstrax goes where the other one is. I think I, I feel like we should put yeah. Where's the where, where's the other Valstrax? Oh, okay. He's the best. Yeah, they're good. Ushala and Teostra resin never fought them. No opinion on them. Yep. yep same. That no thing idea. is... Sh oh, no no opinion on them? But well, that's yeah, we, a we've never fought them. Okay. I, I fought... No, we have. We fought them. Where? In... Uh, in Rise. Oh, yeah. Didn't you guys fight them on Rise on PS4? The Resin? I don't remember. I remember the Risen freaking Kushala. I definitely remember that. And I do remember facing Risen Tailstra. Yeah, no, no idea. Yeah, I'll just put it in Never Fought. And where I love your with the purple one. Yeah. I don't know. I feel like he's a dog. <laughs> you know what? Yeah, he is kind of a dog. <laughs> yeah. <Just, laughs> now that I think about it more, he is a dog. <laughs> he's a dog. <laughs> okay, uh, Ruby Baserios. Eh? He's kind of just Baserios, Probably. but with just... So he's, he's got crystals on his back. Yeah, I'll just put him in bad. He's he he doesn't really bring anything else new or anything. I forget the name of this, but the basically Rust. the desert. Yeah, Rust. the Rust Duramboro. Probably with the regular one. Yeah, honestly. He's the same thing, just a different color. Rusted Kushala Deora. None of us have ever fought that one. Yeah. Rust Razor Cenotar. Never fought it. Never fought. Okay, that puts him in there. Saki Jiva, best. Yeah. best monster. Yep. Best monster. Yeah. Sanbarioth. Only period in one a, game. I fought it a couple times, and it's okay. It's basically Barioth. Yeah. Just with sand. But, well, he actually doesn't have Ice Blight, so there is that. Yeah, that's true. Eh. We'll put him in bad just to make Jake feel good. Yeah. Savage Devil Joe. I, I, best monster. I kinda best want, monster. Yeah, okay. I kind of also want to put him in terrifying a little bit, but we can put him in best. He was only terrifying because we found one that was godzilla size. Fucking Scarred Yinguruga. You do whatever you want with that, that insect wave. What, Brent? William loves that one. Oh, jeez. Yep, I'm putting him in here. <laughs> he he nope. scares the shit out of me. Oh, Scored right. Magnamalo. Oh, terrifying. Absolutely. Terrifying. <laughs> Uh, the magic use. fucking report. shit. <laughs> right there. Uh, Celtus Queen. I'm going to put her. Where's the other Celtus? Oh, you were in the right spot. She's good. Oh, uh, I see. Yeah, I think she's good. Uh, I'll put her husband. Put her husband with her because he wasn't that bad. Because yeah. they were. Because when you first see him, it's not that bad together. Yeah, I'm just, I'll glump them all together. Sir Regios. Great monster. Yeah. Only because of all the fucking Reggie memes. Oh, uh, Stretch Joseph was fun. And also the whole auto uh, sharpening. Or auto reload. Beautiful. Yeah, that was so much fun. Duran Magala probably belongs in either good or great, mainly because that cutscene of it shedding is yeah, just cool. I think he's his, great. Sharu Magala, I think he's great. His fight was just good. Uh, and then I have not fought this one. I don't think I fought it either. So oh, well. let's do that. Uh, Shara is Valda. Eh. Yeah, it's okay. Wait, wait. 
for shits and giggles, put him in Doug. You got it. I'm, I mean, he kind of is. Oh, shit. No, we haven't fought that one yet. <laughs> no, no, we have not fought on that one. Uh, Are so yeah. you a fan of it? I would say bad. Uh, I'm so, putting him in okay. okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Shrieking like Yana. With the regular one. Fucking, fucking awful. awful. Yeah. Oh, uh, that's the... Uh, which version of Narcilla is that one? Jeez, uh, Desert Narcilla, I think it was? That one, I remember that fight being kind of fun. Yeah. I'll I put remember, him in good. Yeah, I'll put him in good. Swift's his brother. Silver Rathalos. Where's regular... Uh, or not Rath regular, but where's Gold Rathian? Yeah, wherever gold is. Oh, right here in good. Yeah, because both their fights are good. And when they're together, also fun. Which Narcuga is that? I thought we bet them all already. Silverwind! Silverwind! That was it. Oh! I don't remember too much of that one, so I would just kind of go, okay. He does bleed, and everything about him is a sword, but I don't think you fought him, so we'll put him in here. Yeah, I don't think Snow I did Bear and Lagombi. Big Fought that snowball. one. Fuck him. <laughs> Fucking Fuck shit. Him. <laughs> Fucking shit. Saw me. Other... Awful. Soul Seer Mitsusune. I think I, f I actually I don't know if I fought that one. No, I don't think you have Soul. I'll just put him here. Steal your Garand. Does anyone even remember this thing? <laughs> no. <laughs> so probably put him in not worth uh, putting my dick in it. <laughs> Stone Fist. I Orbitar. remember fighting that thing. That thing was cool. Yeah. Uh, I think he was good. That was, Well, that's great, but yeah, yeah let's go with good. Uh, yeah. Oh. I, I don't have a problem with Zenogre because Insect Glaive, but when I didn't use Insect Glaive, I still didn't have a problem with him. Saijin Zenogre, I kind of have a little bit of a problem with. Brent, what's your opinion on it? On what? Saijin, Saijin Zenogre. Zenogre. Dragon Zenogre. Wait, where at? Oh, Angry Flipsy. I like him. I would say good. Uh, I, eh, he's not as bad in roles. So yeah, I'll put him in good. Hey, Ostra? Eh, overrated. Doug. Yeah, extra, yeah Doug. Doug. Yeah. Ooh, uh, Tetradon. He was a good fight. He was actually a good fight. Yeah, he's yeah. good. Yeah, I think he's good. Mm -hmm. Tetsukabra. Wherever the rest of them are. Where? Oh, right in here. Yeah, I Is think it... he's good. Oh shit! Under Lord Zenogre. I fuck. tried to. Oh, I. Uh, yeah. Um, it goes in there. Yeah. I tried to. Oh man. Oh no, not the memories. Oh. Hey, somebody, somebody explain him. So combos never ending. He's a, Zenogre. He's a deviant monster. In other words, he's one of the monsters who survived a hunt. Oh, okay. So he's a stronger Zenogre. And uh, he never ends his combos. They're yep. constant. Yep. Right. He's also got regular color lightning. It's yellow. Is this... All oh, it's Mother... the same picture. Is that All Mother Narwa? Oh, so wait, there's Narwa and then there's an All Mother version? Yeah. I don't remember it, so... Or the other Doug. One. No. Kind of forgettable. Yeah. Tidal Narjalala. I honestly forgot that thing existed. Uh, Doug? Sure. Tiger Stripe okay. uh, Zamtrios. Go to regular Zamtrios first, because Zamtrios in general was just good. We Both don't have them... Zamtrios listed yet. Yeah, we do. Well, he's right down there. Just grab him. Oh, good? Why yeah. not? And then grab him. They're both just good monsters, because they were just basically... Shark frogs. Uh, That's it. I don't... <sighs> Tiger Strap, I'm putting me in okay, mainly because I think he was... I remember actually not having too much fun with him as Zamtrios. Okay, well, I'll, go, I'll go with that, but regular Zamtrios was fun. Tigrex, whatever the fuck you want to do with it, William. I cannot control you on this one. I'll put him in okay. Even though it's your literal name. Yeah, I'm just putting him in okay. You okay with that, Brent? Oh, I think he's awful, but that's just me. <laughs> I'm going with whatever William wants. That's two over one. I'll just go okay. Toby. Toby. Toe beans. He's fun. Yeah. 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 I'm going to fun. Yeah. I'll, I'll put him in good. 
Put him in fucking shit. Put Tizzy in fucking shit. Nope. <laughs> oh, Ooh, Canlos, put it next to Ancator. Yes, so, uh, I think this thing is. Oh, yeah, go on, go on. Uh, Ucanlos is the other version, it's the ice version of uh, Ancator, but instead of having giant fangs, has a giant shovel chin. <laughs> but still, he's just a cool monster. His fight's awesome. God, I miss him. Here comes the crimson chin. Yeah, basically. Speaking of the crimson chin. I don't have I a problem with Ern Garand because I fought that thing a lot in 4 Ultimate. If you would yeah, at least I, move it up to bad instead of awful. Okay, fine. I fought that thing a lot in 3 Ultimate. Yeah, you're oh, Hazak, Fucking you're shit old. with the rest yeah. of them. <laughs> uh, What the fuck is that? I can't even read what, what that is. What the fuck is this monster? Uh, Doug? <laughs> sure. <laughs> <laughs> Someone's gonna be honest. Worth like, putting my goddamn dick in. <laughs> what Brent said, yeah. After most recent, <laughs> what Brent said. I didn't even get to say the name. <laughs> oh that's, man, that's Gendrome, isn't it? Or is no, that's Velocidrome. Velocidrome. Okay. Uh, probably they're, okay or bad. Yeah, they're all. <sighs> The problem is all the drums are basically the same almost. They just got one or two different things, but... Yeah. I think I'll just put them in bad. And then... <laughs> Why are best points there? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh, wait, wait, what about the Kochus? Why aren't they on here? We'll have that represent them. <laughs> <laughs> that's also the Kochu. <laughs> Uh, that's the that's the exploder one. That's, that's a good one. one. That was a good one. I like that fight. That's a, I would say great monster. Honestly. Yeah, 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 yeah. I thought yeah, yeah. I thought she was fun. Viper Toby uh, Kadachi probably okay. belongs. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. I, Volvodon. That one's a fun one. I would yeah. say it's a good monster. It's a good monster. Armadillo. White Fatalis. Put him with Crimson. He's terrifying, but the fight's cool. Yeah, I remember having fun with him. Uh, white Monoblos. I think I'm just gonna I'm... put him next to Monoblos, honestly. Yeah, it's the same thing, just white. Ibushi? I think that's the name it was. Wherever yeah. All Mother is. Didn't Pretty we put sure. one of the All Mothers in Doug? Yeah. True. Zeno Jeeva belongs as a great monster, or probably in best monster, only because of just fucking lasers and. No one ever expected that thing. I think I'll just do great for him. No one ever expected that thing. Okay, regular Yingaruga. One's okay. That's fine. Yeah, yeah, I'm fine with that one. I fought that one back in, I think, either four Ultimate or Generations. Yinkuruku. That's a good fight. That's a really good fight, actually. It's just. Yeah, he's I a good beginner it. monster. Just a good beginner monster. Mm -hmm. Zenogre, I'm putting him in here. Yeah, yeah, Mainly Zenogre's good. because what they did for him in World really uh, helped out, in my opinion, of Zenogre, looking back also, now. his theme is fucking awesome. It's oh, just it's, a, oh, it's it's the, a staple of oh, yeah. Monster Hunter Try. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah Zora Magros is kind of dug. Okay, which one is that? Risen Shagru Mogala. Oh. Never I like, fought. I don't know if I fought in that one, but its actual fight is fun. Primordial Malzino. That's a YouTube Holy thing. I never jeez. Terrifying. Yeah, he was terrifying. And then that's just regular Yangaruga, or is that Scarred Yangaruga? The Scarred Yangaruga is right here. I'm trying to figure out what this one is. I mean, we fought it enough. It's okay. We fought it enough times. Like, we know what to look out for, so. Eh, I'll just put it right next to the uh, other one. Other one. And that's the list. That There's our little list. Of our opinions on shit. Yeah. I love the Doug category, though. It's beautiful. <laughs> A little Doug. <laughs> so then who, Everybody... made, who made the best list? What do you mean uh, by who, the, who made the best like? list? Oh, it's, I want to see how many got on the best. Oh, Why right here. Oh, the best. Yeah, so we yeah. got Gog Mosius. We got the two Nergigantes. We got Dalmadur, uh, Daramoran, the two uh, Rocket Dragons. Dragons. Yukanlos, Ankator. Uh, White and Crimson Fatalis, Gormagala, the guy Chris, uh, Raging Recadios. Yeah, Safi Jiva, Savage Devil Joe, and Zenogre. Uh, these are all pretty strong candidates right here. 
Yes, yeah. they are. And then we have great jogging territory right there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they were used technically once and never again. And, right. to, and do you oh. have any? And do you guys have any words for anyone who thinks that uh, Fatalis right here should be higher? You guys are fucking no. sweat lords. Go outside and touch some grass. I may have never dated, but still, go find yourself a woman. Your sister does count. <laughs> Coming from the cousin fucker. All right. So one more category, and it's going to be top pick from each person. Ooh. From all these monsters across all games, all platforms, your number one recommended monster. Oh, you're, so are basically our favorite? Your favorite, your m best fought. Nice. If you had to say, hey, this is the monster out of all of them, this is the one. Yeah. Plain and simple. And that, that he left a lasting impression on me when I first fought him. Yeah, that too. Like the most, the biggest impression on you. Hands down. If there's anyone I could pick, it's the guy, Chris, straight up. Every single time. Mm. It's Nurgle for me. Just Dur big, biggest impression. Regular Standard Durambaros. Standard Durambaros? Really? Can yeah. Explain? I've never fought in it. So, it's just such a different fight. He's a big monster, but he's slow, but he hits hard, but he has wide sweeping attacks. He does a literal Beyblade spin, and honestly, he also reminds me of Torterra, and that was my, one of my favorite starters. Now, I, I gotta know. If it was an event quest where all three of them were in a fight, who would live? Oh, is this fuck, Mary kill? <laughs> Basically, if all three of these monsters had to fight and only one walked away... Durambros. Okay, oh, ex oh, what, explain. Oh, he could just wait, helicopter wait, wait, wait. his way out. <laughs> no, I don't mean like that. I mean, if they actually had to fight each other. Technically, Nier Degante would win because it'd be kind of just like an all out fight. I'm pretty sure Legaiacris would go down first because Nier Degante and Durambros would both beat its shit in. Yeah. Sorry, William. Unless it's but in water, Durand but if it's in wa near water, though, that'll be a completely different story. But Durambaros against Nier Gigante is not a very fair fight because Nier Gigante could just literally push him over. <laughs> <laughs> I've fallen and I can't, can't get, get up. up. No, that's literally what you did. I, I used to use a hammer against Durambaros all the time. You smack it in the legs a few times and while it's spinning and it'll actually fall over. Yeah, I remember that. Oh, it was good. He also had a funny animation when he falls over too. Yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah! All right, Good fight. And, uh, and along with top pick, we might as well do a worst pick. Uh, it's already down at the bottom. Oh yeah. Okay. So from then, where, from that list, <laughs> what would you delete? I yeah, I would just say delete monster. <laughs> uh, hang on. You already fucking know mine. Uh, I'm just gonna do this. Just I fucking... feel so sorry for the people who made Velcana. Just fucking deleted. We're putting them both down in there. Fuck that. I hate those All two. All right, Josh. Who you got? Who's just your deleted? <laughs> Honestly, put the best boys in the cone shoes in there. <laughs> really? Just, no, just it's got to be a large them. monster. We aren't going to include those guys. Come on. Give me a yeah, large monster. It's, it's got to be. Put that, then put Giganox in there because that thing is terrifying. <laughs> what? Do really? you actually Giganox? hate that or why? Oh, no. It's just out of pure terror. <laughs> Pure no, no, we're, 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 okay, but we're talking your most hated monster. Oh, then Plesioth. Like, yeah, I've been not care for, delete, just fucking sucks. Yeah, Plesioth, just fuck that thing. Yeah, I can understand that. Just fuck that thing. All, All right, right, cool. There you go. Final list, right there. <laughs> if you don't like it, well, then go touch grass, I don't know. Yeah, go touch grass. Just because you can do Fatalis doesn't mean you're better at life. I wonder how many dislikes I'll get for, for, for the fact Fatalis is down here in <laughs> fucking shit. 